I'm lo loving the dialogue in here. <laughs> Try not to get caught in Sekola's teeth. Trisixus. I'm sure he wouldn't appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. I I see, of course. Most exalted Ixiltatokal. Well, she's taking it well now, is she? <laughs> Very well. Ah, now that that little dispute is over with, perhaps we can get down to real business, eh? <laughs> Are you bitter, Telocasio? No, most exalted one. As as long as the prophesized ones deal with the rebels, they will have served the purpose Sekola intended. The rebels, <laughs> that's right. And here I was on my coral throne, forgetting all about those rebels. That is an excellent task to set these surface dwellers on. If if I may speak, most honorable one, as to the Shark Father's intentions. Eh? Are you still here, Sentili? Didn't I just have you sacrificed? Oh my god, this guy is senile. <sighs> that was uh, Tlisixio's honorable exiltatical. Oh, how disappointing. Well, I suppose you can speak then. I urge you not to listen to the Baron. He would have you destroy the rebels when there is a far greater need for them in the city of caverns. Our numbers dwindle, honorable Ixiltatokal. You have exiled money. The hatcheries are barren and there are too few females. What are you implying? <laughs> we have three females, but I don't think that is gonna work. I don't think we share the same DNA here. In short, our bloodline grows thin. We need these rebels to join us, to add their blood to ours, so that the city of Caverns may grow strong again. But maybe these rebels are just the guys that he exiled. He, the, This king doesn't seem to me like he's very capable, I'd say. I see what you say, Senitili. Oh, yes, I do. We should have the rebel and his army join us, in principle. The Drow and the Hilithids, Hilithids take more each year. I've no wish to, retreat to the depth, retreat to the depths. But no, I'd rather have the rebel's heart. But, but honorable Ixiltetokal. Excellent decision, our king. I thought you would like that, my baron, but I am not doing it for you. The rebel will invade. Uh, with his army of exiles, if he isn't stopped, you know. So yeah, rebels and exiles are the same. Exiled people, Saudians, are, are the same. I see what's happening here. So it comes down to you, surface half-elf. I am sure you have no wish to help a race such as us. But if you've no objection to killing a few... Hunt down the rebel leader for me, my half-half. Bring me his art and I shall reward you with great, great riches. We'd best be careful, Jeanne. I don't know how much I trust this king to remember we're supposed to be rewarded and not eaten, you know? Yeah, I think he will forget, possibly. Your kind does not object to sorcery. We have collected much that is magical during our raids. You are welcome to it all if you bring me his heart. So what do you say to that? My surface half elf chosen of Secola. Who is this rebel and where would I find him? Oh, this particular one is a former rival for my position that I sent away years ago. What was his name again, my baron? Prince Vilinati, exalted one. Right, Vilinati. You can find the rebels outside the city. He should be no match for one as powerful as you, my little half-elf. I can't fight this rebel if I'm a prisoner. No, th this doesn't work really because they're not uh, holding us, really. I don't feel like we are prisoners anymore at this point. I would prefer to negotiate a peace as the High Priestess suggests. Well, I don't want a piece, I want his heart. You're the chosen of Sekola, after all, and the rewards would be magnificent, I can assure you. 
so I have no choice. I wish the game was more clear sometimes uh, about the choices because what I'm thinking now is that maybe I'm going to fight them, these people right here in front of me. And uh, uh, Charisma is out of the window, um, <laughs> I cannot use it because ideally I could actually convince him to negotiate a peace in some way or another but I do not really have the option to do that. Um, if we kill him right here and now and then contact the rebels, maybe the rebels will still... Uh, the rebel king will be better than him, maybe. But I really don't know how to do this, which option I can choose to leave... Uh, you know, to have an open choice. Uh, what if I reach this prince and talk to him and I want to side with him at some point? I can't fight this rebel if I'm a prisoner. Like, I'm just curious. Let's see. Prisoner? <laughs> you are the chosen of Sekola, my little surfer, surf, surface half F. You have been sent to us by the prophecy. After we're done here, you can wander off on your way. Rest. Rearm yourselves. Whatever it is that you surf f surface people enjoy doing, I suppose. Soon you leave the city and kill this rebel prince, saving the city of caverns as the prophecy foretells, and I shall reward you with great riches. I think saving the city of caverns means repopulating the city of caverns. I don't think he got it. Until that time you will have the free run of the city of caverns. Go where you wish, my good alpha. But, but most honored one, you wish to let them lose in the city? They are doing us a great service, my baron. I want everyone to treat them like... Like... Um, like oddly colored, small toothed, skinny fellows, sawajin. Yes, like that. Very well, I will try to find this rebel you speak of and return his heart to you. Good, the less rebels running about, the better. You shall save the city and be rewarded. Everybody will be happy, except for Vilinati. And then you'll be free to go off to the Underdark, if that's where you're headed. Unless you'd care to try the oceans again, my little half-elf. But off you go, chosen ones. I desire meat now, and the king always dines in private. Before you leave the city, surface beings, come to the temple and speak to me again. I can tell you things that will make your job much easier. Yeah. Okay, she's helping us. Yes, our priestess shall tell you how to gain access to the rebel camp. The rebels are locked away with magic, you know. Go now and destroy them. Um, let's go around here. Can I talk Gosh. more to him? Aha, my favorite surface half half wishes to speak to me once again. Do you have the heart of that rebel? I would so enjoy eating it now. Yeah, later. Well, what are you waiting for? The rebel awaits. I would like to be there when he sees your hairy hides. <laughs> but the king can't have everything. This is Terokassil. Stand away from me, surface creature. Your scaleless features fill me with more than a little revulsion. Do as the most honored Ixil Tetokal has commanded you and I shall be content. Sorry. Who are you? Shuttle me. Royal Guard. But good killing grounds, nevertheless. Uh. Ah, uh, okay, that's locked. That's probably the royal palace. I don't think we can get in there. The city is beautiful. It should be preserved. If you plan on passing this point, surface human, you should be warned that it is not truly part of the city of caverns. Okay? Beyond here lies an old place, home to the blackened elves. 
with traps enough to send any of the belly of the shark father. Huh? Traps enough to send any to the, ah, any to the belly of the shark father to die. Enter at your own risk. But where? Here? No, here. I'm going around, yeah, I'm not... This is beautiful. Lovely. What? A good hit. Victory unclear. Destruction. Who are these people? Let's see what your guts be looking like. <laughs> this one as you went. Where are they coming from? But I don't get it. Am I going towards the underdark? And I And I, I didn't get the message. It shall be. Yeah, probably this is the way to the Underdark. But the layout here is quite strange. So the guy talking was this one. <laughs> the statue is beautiful. <laughs> this is this is a disturbingly lifelike statue of some hideous denizen of the deep. The smell of old blood and death permeates the area. <laughs> Actually, it's cute. It's a giant insect. Consider it done. Ah, that's the priestess. Uh, that's the temple then, all right. Let's see what's around here before going to her. Wow! Oh my god. What? What have I done? What have I done? I didn't... I don't get it. That area is off limits? Maybe... Uh, yeah. Maybe... Maybe those are the... Rebels? It shall be. Okay, let's go uh, straight talk to her but first let me see can we can we pull this off could Imoen actually get in here gotcha. no it's a magical lock all right let's talk with the priestess because I don't think we have much to do in here <laughs> Jean hello the shark father watches do you require the services of this temple let me see Oh, we can sell you things! Yeah! Do you have the cloak spell? Okay, I sorted the inventories a bit uh, sold some weapons mostly and, and uh, that's about it. everybody has a yeah again I feel like s 
uh, you don't have a necklace, nothing, really. Not even rings. That's a little bit weird. Hmm. I, I hope I haven't lost some of your equipment in the way. Okay. There we go. I will do my best. Such a pity that I can't go here because um, I was looking at this uh, structure, the open mouth, and uh, it looked like one of those uh, fish that you find. Um, like this place is just too darn creepy. I really want out of here. That you find underwater. An offering for you, Sokola. Open your mighty jaws and take this, your former servant, as sustenance for you. Oh god, she's sacrificing the woman. We are mighty, Shark Father. We strike without fear and without remorse. Take this gift as a measure of our power. No! Ah, it is good you have come to see me before you left. The king has made it clear I should instruct you as to how you may enter the prince's base. The prince's base lies at the far end of the city, beyond a chamber with two great doors. Long ago, Sekul appeared there and slew a thousand infidels. He decreed no heretic should again enter the city and seal the doors. He placed his tooth upon the doors so that we could open them. Later the draw came. With powerful magics they stormed the city, led by a mage of great strength. He took Sekola's tooth from our Lux Guardians with the intent of blocking pursuit. The mage built an edifice in the southwest section of the city. He was killed, but his complex remains. Sekola's tooth is guarded somewhere within. We have little need for it. The ocean is the means of our travel, but you need it. Seek out the Drow's construct, foil his guardians and obtain the key. If there is no other choice, I suppose I will have to. Excellent, this brings me to the next point. You must do something for me. Our king is mad. <laughs> yeah, surely your audience, wi audience with him showed you this. He is the result of poor breeding. Like his father, he has executed or exiled far too many of our kind. Our numbers are too few, our blood too thin. We must regain what we have lost. Prince Villain, Villinati, the exile's leader outside the city, is our only hope. So they've been exiling all the strong savages outside of the city. Eventually everyone left inside will be weak. I don't see what we have to do with it though. With the prince on the throne, we would be strong again to fight the Illithidis Il and the Drow. I have been in contact with the rebels and now is the time to strike. What do you say, Alf Alf? Surely you hold no love for our mad king. Help us survive lest we be swept away by the denizens of the Underdark. <laughs> uh, I do really want to help them, but honestly, um, I, I, I mean... I, as a player, have sympathy for them, because I would never let them just die as a species. Because, but they are an aggressive species that eats humans. So honestly, sensibly, I would just help the king and then let them rot, <laughs> honestly. But I do kind of want to see them thrive for more personal reasons. Uh, 
I don't know, because the sensible thing is just to let them sink. Uh, so they won't, you know, uh, eat any other people <laughs> ever. But let's help them regardless, right? Because I want to try... Maybe if we are good to them, they will be, I don't know, um, more lenient towards humans, elf, elf selves in general. Maybe they will remember, I don't know. But more importantly, the kings offered me a reward to kill this rebel. What are you offering me? I can offer you nothing myself. And I know that the exiles have literally the way of gold or magic that you might see as a suitable, re suitable reward. Still, I ask that you speak to the prince. Perhaps, perhaps he has some reward in mind. I beg of you, Alpha. Alpha do not let our mad king destroy my people. Yeah, this is the sensible uh, option, really. Uh, yeah, but... I want to speak with the prince, definitely. I shall try and do what you ask. Good, here is the orb. Keep it in your possession when you leave the city of caverns. You will be approached by an exile to be brought to the prince. I pray that you and the prince can come to an agreement for the sake of all of my people. Go then, and may Sekola guard you from harm. Oh god. This orb was given to you by the Saojin royal high priestess. You can gain an audience with the rebel prince if you take the orb to their encampment. Okay. Uh, we have killed one of these. I suppose this was a rebel or an, an exile or... I mean, whatever. You have the wrong arrows equipped. You too. We are in dialogue mode yes. somehow. Still. Very well. Okay. So we can't enter here. It is a bit confusing, this place. Can't go down. Yeah, this is where the um, um, draw. I suppose the palace of the prince should be this one. What I what is happening? I'm not doing nothing. I don't. I'm <laughs> Guilian. reason we are just killing we are just killing them Done. yeah this fish here um, where are you going to here he almost looks like um, What's the name of those fishes? That those deep, mm, those fishes that uh, live in the deep waters of our planet. And ah, oh, come on! I know what their name is. I know it, but it's not coming to me right now. What 
is happening? Ah, oh, he's in the water. Get down! I am your I have no idea what is happening. Some this, these darts are peculiar. Bolts, okay, we don't need them. Oh. Cloak of mirroring. Though it feels much like normal clothes, this shimmering cloak has on occasion been described as woven water. Its true enchantment becomes apparent when the wearer is attacked directly by magic and all damage caused by spell effects is deflected harmlessly away. That's cool. Who who should have it? Maybe Nira because she's um uh the weakest. Anybody could wear it really and it would be good. Possibly um, my th my tanks would be better with it. Yeah, let's let's um, let let's try giving it to Kagan. Let's try. Um, good item. As you ask. Oh, come on. What's the name of that fish? My blade will cut you down to size. So be it. I am your doom. It shall be. Oh. I shall make this great. Oh, but... hmm. oh, we are tired. Let's try. But we are killing the rebels. Um, why? A dangerous mistake. Why are we killing the rebels? It shall be. Why are we not able to just get in to their place? It's pointless if we keep killing them, right? Why are they not recognizing us? Oh, there's something wrong with this, isn't it? Next swing. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. Rest would be welcome, lest we endanger ourselves. <laughs> I'm pleased that you came. I have stamina and patience, but both of them are dead. Yeah, now we are going to rest. Hmm. Consider it done. Oh. You must watch your every move in a place such as this. Dark, foul magic is part <laughs> of these pits like the fire. What is happening to Valigar? He's uh, he has eighteen eight. Um, Hit points. It's, it's 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 that energy drain thing, or it's something else. 
something I gave him. Is it this one? No, right? I don't know, I don't remember him having so little hit points. I suppose it's the drain. That did something. If only there was a way to know. Yeah, the only offensive symbol that I see here is the drain, and also again as one. Corgan, Corgan. <laughs> I will do my best. Okay, so there's something there. What is happening? What are those, those those things? It's the magic cloak. Are they fighting amongst each other? They probably are. This is a massive gaping maw that rises from the water to form an altar. This appears to have been a temple to the Saudian god Secola. It has been deserted recently. Most <sighs> well, they di they're dead now. <laughs> oh, come on. It has been deserted recently, most likely to do the due, to, due to the rebel invasion. All right. Oh, we did it. If only I could remember the name of that fish. Lantern fish? No, right? Very well. No, that's that's not the name in English. But it's that fish, that deep surface fish that has like a um, protuberance that's actually, that has light <laughs> and uh, it, it, he uses it to attract prey in the deep dark ocean and then the mouth is behind him and uh, he... Done. As soon as something gets close to the light, he will eat it. We are killing them all. <laughs> That's not a good thing, right? Victory, un destruction, certain. So be it. I am your doom. They killed each other a bit. As you ask. I find it weird that they use crossbows. Let's see what your guts be looking like. For the fallen! A good hit. It shall be. Had to drop your item on the ground. I can carry no more. Really? Consider it done. Hmm. This is the end of the map. Okay, good. <laughs> 